Our first guest, Gigi Allen, has been called the most violent man in rock and roll. Some of what you're about to hear may not be suitable for children. Also, four nights after Gigi Allen taped this broadcast, he gave his last concert here in New York. As usual, his performance was fraught with the onstage violence that had become his trademark. The next day, Gigi Allen was found dead. A police investigation is underway into the cause of his death, but a drug overdose is suspected. What follows is Gigi Allen's last interview. Parental discretion is strongly advised. This rock musician says he has more power over your children than you do. I have such a, a, a fierce, intense fire burning inside of me that just was, was so much that just wants to explode. Gigi Allen brags he's on his way to becoming the leader, the messiah for America's youth. He already claims to have a million followers. Wherever he goes, he plays to sell out crowds. And this is what they see. Concerts filled with violence, bloodshed, and sexual assault. Gigi Allen wants to lead America's young people in a bloody revolution to take over the country. And he says nothing can be done to stop him. Why is that, Gigi? Nobody will stop you because I am the true underground messiah. When you come to my show, you're going to a war. And I'm out for violence, chaos, un lawlessness all the way. I don't care about anybody or anything except for myself and my mission. And your kids out there, if you've got kids out there, they're going to be my kids. I'm going to own those kids. They're going to do anything that I say. And why is that? Why do they do anything you say? Because I'm the king. And they can identify with me because the real true nonconformist children in this country are sick and tired of their parents, their schools, their people force feeding them what to do. I am the answer. When they listen to my lyrics and they listen to my songs, they're listening to the way okay. that it really should be. And you know that and I know that. So don't brain because your kids are my kids all right let me i don't mean any disrespect here i had never heard of you before we were going to do this show okay and i did a lot of reading about you all right now i want to know is this you seriously mean what you're saying absolutely this is not i've act. been doing this ever since i was a child i have been this is what you see is what you get i do this when i wake up tomorrow morning i'll still smell the same way i'll still look the same way this is not a show this is not that i am that guy now do you okay do you honestly believe yes. that you're a charismatic figure I believe that I am the king. I am the messiah. I rule the rock and roll underground. I'm bringing us to a revolution against the government, against the police, against any form of society that is trying to put us down and restrict us in any way, shape, or manner. You cannot conform. You must be a true nonconformist. To hell with what your parents have to say. Okay, okay. I am the man. Okay. So all you have to do is listen to what I have to say. Okay, well, who told you you were the Messiah? I said I was. Okay. And I am because these kids, I get letters from all over the world. People worship me. They come to my shows. I'm going to rape the girls. I might rape the guys. I might have sex. I'm, I want it all. I want it all, and I'm going to have it all. Okay, let me ask... Because I am everything. All right, yeah. You, uh, you go way beyond sex, drugs, and rock and roll in your performances. You uh, self-mutilate on, on I self stage. I self-mutilate. I beat the <laughs> out of my audience. If they're in my way, I take them out. I don't care. I don't care about anybody or anything. When you come to my show, I'm the boss. I'm the king. You do what I say. You can challenge me. I have no problem with yeah. that. I, I like the confrontation. Yeah. But you're going to lose. All right, do you... Are you, are you proud of what you do? Absolutely proud of what I do. Why are you proud of what you do? Because I am who I am, and I'm not a phony like everybody else out there. I am real. And I, how many of you can, at 35 years old, sleep with 16, 12, 13-year-old girls and boys and animals? Hey, this is the life. I got it all. And I got your kids. You worried about him, audience, or what? Yeah? You better be. How many of you aren't worried? How many of you think this is so ridiculous your kids would never buy you're, into well, it? You're, Okay, right. well, come on. Come what? on, I'll take you on. Well, no, run right, right now. Come on. All right, simmer down. Come simmer on down. down. Simmer down. We'll simmer see, down. won't we? All right. This sounds like you, I mean, it sounds like you're real angry. I've been angry since the day one. I knew the yeah, day well, I why, was born. Why are you so angry? I just hate everybody. There's no need for me to like everybody. Everything that I have in this world, I put back into number one. I am number one. I don't need to give anything to anybody. You don't need to give anything back. I don't need to give anything back. I take it off. All right, why, do you know why you have so much hatred? I have so much hatred because I have this these robots, these, these conformists, these people that dress in their uniforms, and I'm sick and tired of it. What are you wearing? What is this that? This is not a uniform That's for not me. a uniform? You could say it's a uniform. I could say that's a uniform. So I got a but uniform, this is what you I don't I have a uniform. No, this is what I wear every day. If you see me tomorrow anywhere in Manhattan, you'll see me wearing yeah. this, and probably a whole lot less because you people wouldn't let me take my clothes off. 
I'd rather be out here naked. This was a, I want to get new information. We have limited time here. Um, do you what care? Do you, about, do you care about anything? I don't care about anything but myself and what I write and what I do is law. How many times have you been in jail? I've been in jail. I've been arrested over 52 times. I spent three years in prison. If you're so proud of what you do, why don't you look the hat and the sunglasses? You know, you'll never, I, I'll never I can conform look you to right you. I don't conform to say, anybody. I go to school so I can put people so I don't care. So you go to school? You okay? go to school? Yeah, wow. I was, I'm Where do you go to learn in school? You I ain't going to learn nothing in school. Because I'm the only Not one that like can teach you. Take your hat off and sit back down. I'm the only one that can teach you. You can't teach me. I am the Savior. I am the God. And I'll look you straight in the eyes. And I'll tell you that because I am the Do God. me a favor. Would you sit? Would you sit? All right, you're not on mic back there. Sit down for me.